Father <laughs> Winter. Hi. You're sweating too. Hey. Today I am bringing you a brand new episode of Promise Legacy and we are actually going to be playing with Jasper today. With that being said, let's get into today's so episode. So in case you missed the last episode of Promise Legacy, Jasper did get a little bit of a makeover and he is so handsome. I love him and we are going to mainly be focusing on his career and also Cameron realized that he has a crush on Jasper but he doesn't know how to tell him because they've been super super close since they were like little babies and he doesn't know if it's gonna make the relationship weird if he confesses but Cameron's like I have to do something because I do really 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 like Jasper and I feel like I need to shoot my shot and finally tell Jasper that I've liked him for a really long time so it is 1 p.m i'm gonna go ahead and have jasper and cameron go into the city and just have some like time to hang out together because i feel like they haven't hung out just them in so long without cameron's friends or like jasper's family so let's go ahead and have them both hang out on their own at the park there's a little like area here where they can perform but i kind of want them just to sit over here together and just like hang out and talk look at them um, okay they are so cute actually i also want you to change cameron let's not have you be in your workout attire but let's go ahead and sing about spooky day because it is halloween but let's go talk to jasper a little bit more and like just casually talk to him about work and stuff and the stardom life cameron's like how do i tell this guy that i've known since i was a baby that i like him is he gonna think i'm weird maybe we we can like call up Fern and ask her for advice. He thought he was gonna tell Jasper, but he's just like, maybe this is a bad idea. So we'll just have them just hang out over here and have some good time together. Okay, so we need to do guitar level three and fitness level five. Are you serious? Okay, well, there's a guitar over here. Maybe Jasper, you can go ahead and practice that. You can't use it. Why not? What is this little kid doing? Are you freaking out over Cameron, really? Oh my god, Jasper, are you okay? Wait, can we like move this and maybe you'll be able to use it? Oh, here we go, yes! And when Cameron gets nervous, all he wants to do is clean. Let's go call Fern and just chat with her really quick and be like, Fern, I know you're a little bit busy, but is there any chance that I could be able to see you sometime? And Fern's like, yeah, Cam, you can see me whenever. And baby Ivy would love to see you. So whenever you're not busy, feel free to stop on by. And then Cameron's like, okay, I'll see you when I can. But Jasper, it's just really into focusing on his career right now because Jasper wants to prove to the people that he can make it even though he doesn't have like any celebrity connections like Cam does and then we have Cam over here freaking out about having a huge crush on Jasper and he doesn't know how to say it <laughs> so we're gonna go ahead and have Cam go all the way over to Brandon Bay again and see Fern and talk to her we are here and Butter is here to greet us let's go ahead and knock on the door and have cam go ahead and greet the promise family hello it's good to see everyone i love how everyone's in their pjs specifically willow and fern are both in their pjs still but fern is like oh my god cam i did not expect you to be here i'm gonna go ahead and go change real quick so don't mind me okay so let's go ahead and have fern change out of her pajamas because <laughs> she's like oh no cam i did not expect to see you so quickly oh yeah so we can offer gratitude to fern cameron's like thank you for you know having me come over also hi judy it's good to see you so adorable but let's go ahead and add fern to our group so that way cameron and fern can talk privately so i know this sounds really really weird and i don't know i just i don't know if i'm overthinking it or something but i need advice and i feel like you're the only only other person I can talk to but I have a crush on Jasper and I really don't know how to tell him and she's like you have a crush on Jasper and Cam's like wait you said that really loud and Cam's like yes 
I have a crush on your brother and I've liked him for a really long time but I didn't really realize how much I liked him until him and I moved in together and we spent so much time together and I just I really really like him and I I don't know how to tell him because I don't want to ruin the relationship I have with him also if anything does happen between us I don't want to ruin the relationship I have with you and your mom and your dad because your family is like my second family and I would hate to ruin the relationship that we had and then Vernon's like there is nothing for you to worry about ever since your mom passed away you became part of our family even if you and Jasper didn't work out you still have me you still have my mom you still have my dad sure it might be a little bit awkward if you know jasper were around but just know that you'll still be part of our family and it's always been like that cam and i say if you like jasper like how is he ever gonna know that you like him what if he starts to get into a relationship and it was too late for you and him to have a chance and then cam's like fern you're so right this is why i'm so happy i saw you because i've been really anxious and like nervous especially around your brother i thought him and i living together would be fantastic but then i started developing these feelings i'll definitely think about what you said and maybe when the time is right i'll go ahead and tell jasper that i like him and now cam is like can i see baby ivy and then friends like yeah of course she's up here oh and she's crying okay let's go up here oh my god hi no taking care of his granddaughter but i want to say hi to ivy hi baby ivy you are so so adorable oh okay i love that but we should probably get home cam because like jasper's probably wondering where you left too but bye everyone it was so good to see you again and thank you fern like seriously thank you fern for everything oh, nice okay jasper reached level three see he is so serious about his career Career. Let's have you practice. Oh wow, you can cry on demand too. Uh -huh. Wow, Jasper. I love how Cameron is just watching. Oh, what the? That's a jump scare. Oh my god. Yes, hello, trick or cheater. Oh, did you get scared? I got scared. Okay, let's go do a friendly introduction to the trick-or-treater. Hi, you scared the living poop out of me. I don't think I can give you the treat, but I'm gonna need you to get out of my house. Thank you. I did not appreciate you jump scaring me. <laughs> Jasper, don't use the bush. You have a nice fancy apartment and you want to use the bush? No. Okay, when is your audition actually? Oh, it's tomorrow. All right, all right. Let's go talk to Cameron a bit more. Okay. <laughs> oh, wait, Cam, go eat too. Oh, you don't like it? Wait, who made this? Oh, you did, and you're complaining. Oh my gosh. But Jasper is gonna be kind and be like, you know what? This is so good, Cam. What do you mean? It's delicious. Oh, Jasper, you're so cute. Oh. <laughs> Did that behind his back? Okay, Jasper. Ah, oh, you are so funny. Okay, we can have them have Cameron ask Jasper tomorrow night, and then maybe we'll be able to make a move on Jasper then. Okay, your audition is today, Jasper. So is Cameron's. Let's go definitely have you practice your acting a little bit more. And then Cameron, where are we at with your fitness? Oh, you're level four. I don't know if you'll be able to make it before then i mean let's go try look at jasper though from single and loving in lifestyle there's nothing like the sweet smell of independence after a nice long sleep jasper loves waking up single <laughs> jasper your life is gonna change soon hey neighbor i'm starving can i raise your fridge and have some food help me out here we can hang out too mom <laughs> what do you mean okay i guess we can invite you to eat but i have auditions in like an hour you really want to see us that badly huh willow our mom is so funny she misses her kids so much that she wants to barge in as much and you're gonna cook you're the one that's gonna cook i thought you were the one that was gonna eat our food she's so funny though i love her jasper i love your mom she's too funny but 
uh, they have their auditions. Good luck. Yay! Oh my god. Cam passed his audition. I really thought he wasn't because he didn't get level 5 of the fitness, but he did it. Maybe he got a pass because he's Judith's son. And <gasps> Jasper did it too. Yay! Yeah, okay. So Cameron, you are very sad. I feel like Cameron's kind of sad because he's just like, did I actually earn this role or did I get it because I'm just Judith Ward's son? So he's just going through it. But like Jasper is like, oh my god, I did it. I earned it. So Jasper is super happy. Yeah, look at him. He wants to dance and everything. Mom, you're literally still cooking. Mom, I love you, but you're gonna have to go, okay? I love you, mom. We'll see you in another day but as a celebration jasper and cam are definitely gonna go hang out at the the club yes okay i love this club it's so gorgeous but let's go have them sit over here together and jasper is so happy but then there's cam he was super sad because he's just <coughs> father winter hi but oh my god you're sweating too cam is super 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 nervous but he's like, okay, this is it. This is your time. If you want what you want, you're going to have to put yourself out there. So we're going to start flirting with Jasper and be, and he got the romance skill. Love that. Compliment his appearance a little bit. Jasper's feeling flirty. So this is not fun for Cam either because he has all these fans around him while he's just trying to be private with Jasper. But let's go. F oh my God, he passed out. But we're going to go ahead and and blow him a kiss and just be out there and be like, Jasper, I know this might sound weird or whatever, but for a really, 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 really long time, I actually admired you. I actually liked you, but I never knew how to tell you because we were like super, super, super close. And I never knew if you felt the same way about me. So I pushed those feelings away. But ever since we moved in together, I can't stop thinking about you. It pains me to live with you to know that I have this super big crush on you. So yeah he's gonna tell him his secret and just confess his true feelings to jasper and jasper seems to be shocked but he's feeling flattered but there goes cam he's finally telling him the truth and he's feeling confident so let's see how this goes oh okay i'm so nervous for you but let's go in for the first kiss person ever kiss adoring best friends lovebirds is that a memory i think that was a memory that was a memory you kissed someone and it was finally with the guy that you've had a crush on for such a long time and then how is he feeling he's feeling super inspired he's like I can't believe you've liked me for this long, Cam. I've been so wrapped up with my career and our work and everything like that. And I just put like love and romance out of the picture because I just want to prove myself that I can become a celebrity. And especially knowing the It Club and everything, I want to prove to them that I can be a someone. And then Cam's like, you know what? The It Club, I don't even enjoy being in that club. I'm only in that club because because I'm the son of Judith Ward and I got easy access to that but I don't even like the people that's in that club. It's not even worth being in that club because they only ever care about themselves and they only care about climbing up the social ladder and I'm honestly not about that life Jasper. And I don't want the Hollywood life. I don't want that celebrity life. I just want a quiet life and honestly I just think I'm just gonna quit the A club because they're not my friends. So Cam is definitely gonna cancel his membership and knowing that cam is just like i don't know if this celebrity life is for me like i really really wanted to do this for my mom and like continue her legacy but it's not for me but jasper if you want to continue becoming an actor i will support you through and through i will be there for you i will help you with your career and anything you need anything you want i will be your right hand man when it comes to that and i believe in you jasper i believe 
believe that you can be great. I believe you can be an amazing actor, but I just, I don't think I want to be an actor anymore. I want to make music. I don't want to be an actor. That was my mom's thing. And Jasper was like, oh, Cam, I didn't know this. Oh, no, not the paparazzi. <gasps> Y'all are really ruining this moment. Okay, you know what? Let's go back home, but let's definitely ask him to be our boyfriend now. Yeah. So sweet. Let's go back home, you two, and talk more about this. So let's go have them sit over here and continue their discussion because, like, the paparazzi were just too much. Cam's like, oh, this is why I'm tired. I'm tired of being in my mom's shadows. I want to be my own thing. I want to live my private life. And I just, I'm done being in the spotlight. I'm done. Yeah, here we go. He's just like, I quit being an actor. I quit being a celebrity. I just want to be a private person. So we're going to quit the spotlight because Cam is done with that. And there we go. And Cameron's like, I don't want my decision of leaving the spotlight stop you from your career. I believe in you. I see the ambition in your eyes. That's what attracts me to you so much to see how hardworking you are, how determined you are. And I believe that you're going to be an amazing actor and just know I'll be supporting you in the sideline and I will be there for you every step of the way. And then Jasper's like i really appreciate you and i totally respect your decision and i want you to know that you are more than just your mom okay the tabloids always label you as judah ward's son but just know you are talented as cameron i see the talent that you have and it makes me sad to see all these social media just label you as her son but you are more than just her son and i will support you every step of the way when it comes to your career in writing music and then Cameron's like, oh my god, Jasper, you don't know how long I've been wanting to tell you this has been killing me for so, so long. And I feel free now. I feel like there's so much weight lifted on my shoulders and I just, I'm ready for this new chapter in my life. And Jasper is like, me too, Cam. Me too. And with that, that is the end of Jasper's main story. So Cam and Jasper are now officially dating and Cam officially quit the spotlight to create music on his own terms and with Jasper, Jasper is going to be continuing his acting career with the help of Cameron being his support through the whole thing and yeah so these two are now dating. They're still gonna be living in the place that they're currently living in because I see Jasper loving the city life so he definitely wants to stay in the city life but yeah so that is basically where we have Jasper and Cameron's story come to an end. So from here on out, we're going to be focusing on Fern and everyone else in the family back home in Brindleton Bay. So yeah, I hope you all enjoyed this episode. This won't be the end of Jasper. Don't worry, he's still going to be visiting the family and all that fun stuff. But till then, thank you everyone for watching this episode. I will see you all in the next episode. Bye everyone!